Northrop Grumman's 12th resupply mission to the International Space Station carries with it the most diverse set of experiments launched on its Cygnus vehicle to date. A majority of these payloads are sponsored by the ISS National Laboratory and touch on everything from new research facilities to life science investigations, advanced materials, and more. Here's a quick snapshot of the payloads launching on this mission. The recent addition of Cygnus Capsule's late load capability enhances opportunities for life science researchers to fly critical payloads to station. This launch will mark the first ISS National Laboratory rodent research mission flown on a Cygnus. In this mission, researchers from Baylor College of Medicine will use a mouse model to evaluate whether the stress of microgravity serves as a disruptor of circuitidal rhythm, a 12-hour cycle of gene expression that influences metabolism in mice and humans. Results from this research could help lead to new treatments for metabolic disorders such as liver disease and conditions related to obesity. Automobile Lamborghini and the Houston Methodist Research Institute are collaborating on a study aimed at examining 3D printed carbon fiber composites on the outside of the space station. The investigation will test the performance of the components designed for use in aerospace applications in the extreme environment of space. Successful validation of 3D printed carbon fiber composites in space may impact carbon fiber manufacturing on Earth, replacing lengthy and expensive traditional manufacturing methods. Additionally, knowledge gained from this study may improve the design of implantable medical devices developed by Houston Methodist Research Institute for therapeutic drug delivery. Maiden Space is seeking to demonstrate an in-orbit recycling facility to process plastic waste into a uniform feedstock for use in additive manufacturing. Also on this mission, Nanorax will perform a technology demonstration of its Zero-G oven, which aims to provide new methods for food preparation on spaceflight missions. Lastly, Lockheed Martin will conduct a technical demonstration of its Astro Rad Vest, which is designed to mitigate radiation exposure for astronauts in space. Knowledge gained from this demonstration could also aid in the development of shielding technologies for patients on Earth receiving radiation treatments and personnel who work in areas where radiation exposure is a risk. That's a quick snapshot of the more than 20 payloads sponsored by the ISS National Laboratory on this mission. To learn more, visit issnationallab.org.